Hey folks, this is Game Master Mike, and I'm making this video is because starting next month, I am going to upgrade the Retro Bat Cave by purchasing more furniture. Now, as you can see here, I am overstocked with games, movies, merchandise, and action figures. Now, what I'm making this video is that I'm going to show you all my action figures will be coming out of hibernation for about almost two years now. As you can see, I got a box below, which I am going to show you. There we go. Now, these are my action figures, which I had at my old places. And um, these are been in this box for over two years now. And starting next month, they're going to have a new home on my shelf. Now, um, as you can see, I have all these action figures in perfect condition. Except for Sonic the Werehog there. His leg is broken off, and I've been willing to fix it. And these shields from these uh, Monty Python action figures, I might um, hang them up on my wall to uh, save tons of space. So I am, there's King Arthur. So I am happy that I um, want to do a ton of upgrading. Got tons of Lord of the Rings figures or some strong bad. Eme Mills. Yeah, Strong Bad. Lots of Final Fantasy figures. As you can see. So, yes, I am extremely thrilled. I'm definitely going to buy a second entertainment center, as you can see. Get like a few more of these splitters. As you can see, I've uh, marked them down. I got lots of consoles um, there. They're going to get a nice place on my a second entertainment center. I'm going to buy um, another these types because it is a lot sturdier. It can fit even more consoles. So um, with these two, I'm going to like stack the TV on between both of them to make it look like extremely retro. And I'm thinking about also getting a futon here. Yeah, I put a futon near my bed so my dog can sleep to it. And get a doggy bed too. That would be extremely cute. Well, folks, I'm also thinking about m making a construction game room tour about my process of making it in parts. And I want to give you a heads up of um, what's going to be on my game room tour construction. Who knows? I might be making a um, game room tour video in advance that would be nice if I can like get everything um, organized because my room is a complete mess I'm also going to add some space for my uh, retro handhelds there and until next time I'm going to keep you guys up to date about my game room tour construction and until next time folks thanks for watching